Hi guys. <coughs> um, so this is the second Wednesday video today. I was going to do one, but um, I decided as I've picked up some bits on my way home and I've just had a parcel come, so I'm going to do a mini parcel opening, box opening, and be quiet, pigeons. I've got pigeons in my tree. Um, <coughs> yeah, so. I walked home from my garage, I've got the video up in a bit, well, before this one, of walking through the woods, and yeah, we did find, when I was walking through the woods, um, it's not the most exciting thing, but this, and this is a mini solid fuel stove, um, but not the most expensive things, they're about five or each, um, but it was just left, and I'm kind of dilemma and it's like, because when I was walking in the woods, I did see looked like a shelter tarp thing, and I don't know if it was maybe a homeless person there or something like that. So maybe <clears throat> they'd left it out, um, but it was a distance away from where it looked like their setter was, um, and it was potentially hazardous because you know dogs walking down there and stuff. So you no know, dog could have stamped on it because theoretically, if you stomp on it, it would go. Um, you know, could have been used by. Um, not meaning to sound horrible, but you know, a drug user of some sort, um, cause, you know, for being so. <clears throat> I've got it home. Um, I scrubbed it, bleached it, cleaned it, um, and it's all right actually. You know, it folds it like that, and then there's a little thing like that which just needs bending in a bit on the one side. So, <clears throat> and yeah, but yeah, I'm dilemmering. Do I take it back or do I keep it? take it back and leave it, then technically I'm littering. So, I don't know, what do you think? Keep, two to a boot. But yeah, you know, it was cheap, well, free, and they're not that expensive, so, yeah, anyway. Right, so we've got that, which is cool. Uh, <coughs> and what else? I've got coffee. Mm, I'm outside, it's nice, it's cold, it's really cold today, it was minus two this morning when I got up. Um, it's about four or five degrees, maybe six at the moment. It's a chilly day, but it is, as you can see, quite a nice bluish sky. Um, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully it's gonna be dry today. I've got some washing out. Um, yeah, I'm outside. I thought, why not do a video outside? So yeah, <coughs> so. Right, so I went um, through the village on my way back, did my long walk, da da da, and I picked up something. It's not the most exciting thing. Um, it's not for wild camping as such, but it was cheap and I thought, why not? I got this. This is a Woolworths brand. Anybody remember Woolworths? <coughs> they went out of business about. Geez, 10 plus years ago. Um, Woolworths brand, and it's a little portable barbecue stove. Um, <coughs> don't get me wrong, I love my fire pit. I think it's ace. It throws ridiculous amounts of heat out. Um, it burns hot, uh, it's got plenty of airflow in it. It's, it's really, 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 really good um, fire pit, but it's terrible for. Um, barbecuing, cooking food because there's so much separation between the coal bed and thing. So, every time I've been to the charity shop in Orch, I have seen this. And it was a fiver, and I've been like, eh, 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 should I, shouldn't I? So, I looked at it again yesterday and I checked online, and they're about something equivalent is about 20, 30 quid, and it was a fiver. So I thought, do you know what? Why not? It's old, it's Woolworths brand. Um, I don't exactly know how old, no date on it, but it's still all sealed. It comes with a free cleaning brush. Um, and the original price on it apparently was 29 pounds. There's a little sticker there actually, which I'm going to say. Yeah, can't see. Right, so it's going to open. So I put you there. You still see? Spit my coffee. Okay. <clears throat> so I've got my 
little pen knife. This is one of a little pen shop pen knives. Um, I've actually sharpened it up. Um, it's actually quite got quite a nice keen edge on it there. Um, it, it's not really going to hold an edge, but yeah, for a quid, it's actually all right. Yeah. Bit of time on the whetstone, nice and slow, and it's got a decent, decent sharp edge. So anyway, let's, let's give it a go. Open one side. <coughs> and let's see what's in the box. This is all brand new. Wow. That's it. <coughs> okay, so it comes with two little things. Oh, some assembly required. So a little brush. A little paper. <coughs> Handles. We've got feet. We've got lots of stuff. Ah. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Should we turn this into a build video? Yeah. Why not? Actually. Why not? Indeed. Any doubts, ideas? Once I build it, I won't be able to go back and. Hmm. Yeah, we'll build it. <coughs> I was hoping it'd be more portable. So, right, so we're coming back it away. See, it is all new. It looks like it. it. Doesn't even look like it's ever been used. It's all shiny new. Right. Instructions. Okay, so. Assemble wood supports and air vent to ash tray. Right. Tools needed. Pliers and a screwdriver. Do you know what? There are a lot of pieces to this. Hmm. What do, what do, what do? Tell you what. We'll unbox the other thing first and then we'll assemble this. So that lets me get away for a bit. Okay. <coughs> Those pigeons are being noisy. Right. So we'll come back to Mr. Grill. And we have a parcel delivered by the <coughs> um, I didn't order it for be delivered by the load until it passed, and I'm glad that today's my day off, so I can actually open it. You still see me? Red. Shiny. That is very bright. Okay, so we have this power extra. And let's get it open. And we have <coughs> um, hopefully these are the right batteries. So yeah, um, I love this camera. It's brilliant. Drains through batteries like crazy. So quickly. Um, and so I had a look on eBay and this came with um, it's a USB charger. A micro USB charger. Uh, it came with two batteries, so there's one, and two. Comes with a USB charger cable as well. No power adapter, but yeah, USB is fine. Um, yeah, so it came with two of those. Uh, this was 11.99, free postage. But eBay were doing a promotion where it was five pound off if you spent ten quid. So it actually came to like six pounds for two batteries and um, charger. I've already got a separate charger anyway, but having an extra one broke hers. Um, so yeah, and this capacity is 1600mAh. Uh, the actual official Sony ones are only 1250mAh, so they may have a bit higher capacity on them. So, um, but yeah, I'm in for six quid for two batteries and a charger. It works absolutely fine. So I can charge these up and leave them and just switch over on the go rather than having to, like what happened with me last week where I was. Um, 
was I doing? <sighs> Recording and the battery died and so on. So. <sighs> anyway. So yeah, I've got those. Oh, that's awesome. Um, yeah, so also, while I was out today, let's pack this away for a second. I don't need all this. Cecil and Sill uh, making nest in the yew tree at the moment. Uh, probably be having babies. Hang on, check them out. Sup. Hey, buddy. I think that's Mama Pigeon. Because she looks a bit of a chunky monkey. Um, currently Dad Pigeon actually. There's two of them. One of them will go out and collect twigs for the nest and the other one just sits there chilling on my shed. Hey buddy. And I'm like, I should scare them off because they're flying rats but I don't know, they're quite cute. Poop bit. They're harmless. Yeah. Just birds. Say hello. Sup. Doink, 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 doink. Where are you going, buddy? Where's he going? So yeah, I don't know, I don't know what to do with that barbecue. Do you know what, I think I'm going to leave the barbecue for today. Um, because it'll take a while and I really, really need to crack on in the garden today because a canopy. Um, so this is a big canopy that we have, the hot tub underneath in the summer and my table and chairs and stuff like that. Um, and it's just one of the canvas canopies and what happens is these holy bits when it gets water on it tends to sag so we bought some screen stuff and cheap like six quid a pack um so i put that on it's all cable tied on and i want to do the next bit there with the other piece of that and i want to get that done today um really I and mean, then i can get the actual canopy on and stuff like that so i think yeah we'll leave the barbecue today um don't need it to build it today there's no purpose for me assembling it today so yeah, um, yeah, so this has been a short and sweet little unboxing. Oh, before I go, <clears throat> while I was out this morning, while I was out this morning, walking through the woods, can you see that? That is an absolute load of birch bark, which I'm gonna dry out properly. Um, for trying to do some, because I'm still, bought my fire steel and <laughs> I'm just a disaster with it, I can't light it. So I'm gonna drive it out and see. <clears throat> anyway, it's been a little unboxing video on a Wednesday for you. Hope you've enjoyed it. Again, like, comment, share, subscribe, do all that kind of stuff. I'll see you in the next one. Um, I might have another video coming up later because I've got to go back to the garage to pick up the car, which may mean I walk through another lot of woods. So it might take you with me. See you soon. <laughs>